I think this will do for us now. We'll be done soon. Well, we have enough supplies to supply the men here, so we're not losing anything on that side. These guys are mighty fine, and our navy is ready to carry them out. First Royal Canadian Fleet. Ooh, Norwegian uprising as well. Yeah, the Nazis gonna have a hard time. Uh, I'm wondering. Oh, should I? Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm gonna liberate Norway. Cause that's what I do as a boss. Seriously, there's like no presence there. All right. Oh god, so many troops. What the hell are you doing? Invasion! Let's try it. Let's just be a little bit aggressive. Let's play this the British way. But this time we at least pull out our troops in time. The Canadians! No, no, no! Did we land at a bad spot? I'm gonna put these guys on a uh, little... They gotta blitz their way through here if they wanna survive. Yes, 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 yes. Beat them back, beat them back, beat them back, beat them back. Yes, Canadians. Yes! Yes! Let's help the Norwegians. Now's the time for the... Oh, we got the our navy here at least, uh, supplying our troops as well. Okay, well, you never know. Well, okay, let's just stop controlling it that way. First army, I can take control now. Thank you. Actually, let's just uh, get the hell out of here again. That was a little, it's a little raid to give the Norwegians. If you can hold them at Voss, that is the question. We should be able to. Oh, yes, 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 industrial capacity. Uh, more, more, more. Some there, some there. Uh, now we need the Air Force to help us out here as well. Oh, they're already being used. I see. They're, where's the the station right here? Uh, bomb? Ground attack? Fuck him up. Bombing at Woda. Looking pretty good. Yeah, we, we gotta we gotta pull our you know ropes as well. Uh, the British are pushed back up here. Pushed in here. And they're doing stuff down there. Yeah, we can definitely hold them here. If we dig in here and it boss, that'll be fine. No, wait a minute. I think we can hold them here. Battle of Vos, we got 25,000 Canadians. They're going for that. Yeah, they will not be able to break us there. And the, the Norwegians got militia here, but they're doing pretty good. Helping our fellow Norwegians. Canadians! We're doing it! Push in, push in, push in, push in, push in. I think I can let the these guys be controlled now for a bit. 
Right. Being an attack and staying, motherfucker. I'm gonna be in a roll to take Trondheim and I will just get Trondheim and of course Narvik. of Norway is underway. Norway can be seen on the map again. <sighs> With the help of the... Yes, yes, yes. The Germans are weak in this area. They're putting... W I don't, I, I'm wondering if we're going to see like an insane spam of Germans here anytime now. It's going to be scary. They can't break me here. Oh, yeah, they did actually. Do we have the supplies needed? Navy? We have to be in an attack and stance to, to liberate this pl pl place as uh, quickly as possible. Ah, the Norwegians just fucking lost the, the edge, man. What's going on? Putting these fools out of boat. I'm removing his command. Putting these motherfuckers back here. To rebasing that shit. And then we're pulling our lads out of here. I, I know at least when to pull out. I know when things have gone too far. Alright. I want you to, to get that air, air intercept in that section there and just help us out. I know when things have gone too far, and these Norwegians will not be holding on to this very long. It looked really good at the start, but I don't think I'll beat these Germans, to be honest. They're a little too combat hardened, so to speak. Got the Finnish Navy out here. Uh, Norwegian submarines. I never knew they had submarines. Did they actually have submarines? Okay, this is what we're doing for now. We're gonna transport these boys home to avoid another catastrophe. We're gonna get these boys home as well. No, my Navy hasn't been taken any hits yet. 1942, the fact that the Russians aren't involved yet is sort of worrying me, because... That's gonna be hard. The British are down here, though. We're fighting in there. Kind of a different taste of the war, like we had with Italy. I mean, Italy. When we played with Italy, they like they won a couple of battles, and then like we we took over Russia for some reason. Everything was just messed up, literally fucking messed up. But it was fun. Oh shit. First Canadian Infantry Division here. Guderain. Oh shit, is it really him? Dreitis Infantry Division. Guderain. Farndale. Mr. Farndale. I recognize that name, Farndale. Get on the boat. Retreating out of Bergen now. The Germans have got a little pesky. <coughs> so to say. So we're, we're, we're taking a. We are leaving! As a certain captain would say. Get on the fucking boat. Get on the fucking boat. Oh god. These guys are fucking screwed. They can't move. They can't do anything. They're like fucked. Okay, I'm not planning to do another invasion, but I really want to get these guys out of here. So... No, but... Alright, if that's how you want to have it, okay, fine. Well, that's gonna work, isn't it? Better that than nothing, isn't it? Decent. It's got me there. Retreat, you fools!
We are leaving. We are leaving. Wait, wait, wait. Let's get everyone. No one, no one's left behind. They're fucking attacked. Battle of Bergen here. Gudrun has chased Farndale. I'm gonna break him. Get on the boat! Get home! Alright. No, wait, wait, wait. Not a fucking invasion. Not inv- We're not invading the UK. Oh, god damn it. Interceptor group. You're flying home now. I'm not losing my all my airplanes. Is that- That's a combined navy, isn't it? Not even showing up. Yes, there you are, there you are, there you are, there you are. Stop fucking about. Transport everyone back here now. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Pentagon is finished. Oh, there we go. Finally, they're pulling back home. No! Okay. At least they went out of there. It took its time, but... <sighs> Casualties... We took about, we took about ten thousand troops losses there, but we fought for a pretty long time all over here. I mean, that was that was okay. That was okay. That wasn't the worst. We've been through. We've been through worse. The British have been through worse, and the the Allies have been through worse during the war. So, Canadian efforts um, disrupting the Germans, sort of like buying. It was a try. It's worth every fucking shot you get. It is worth every single one. Trust me. That was definitely worth it. But once the Americans get involved, I mean, they're gearing up. I hope they are. Yeah, they're all moving to the Eastern Front. Most of it. Some of it, at least. They got quite a lot here on the Western Front as well. They're obviously fighting the Pacific War right now. Fighting the Japs down here. Mili. Majuro. Bikini. Wake, Midway, Johnston, Hawaii. Is that Hawaii? Hilo. Yeah, that's Honolulu. Yeah, that's that's Pearl Harbor there, isn't it? Or am I just way off the track? I think it is. Ooh. These uprisings everywhere are gonna be hard to deal with when there once there are many. I wish they could combine effortly and just do it everywhere over the map at the same time. This place remains in Canadian <laughs> control. <laughs> Will he not retake it? That is the question. What if they were to be invaded? The British would be screwed, wouldn't they? I mean, I guess they'd have a fairly good chance at pulling it off, but... You better be careful. Germany has done those f fucked up shit things before. Where did my navy go? It's up there. Alright. Well, I want you to rebase. I didn't take any losses there, so that's good. How are we doing with the reinforcements here? 79,000. Are we getting the men we need? Yep. I'm being sent here from our homeland. Reinforcements going to go up now to 42 there. Yeah, there we go. Replenishing here from the manpower. I'm moderately satisfied with the performance. It could have been way better, but I am moderately. Moderately happy. Airplanes are okay as well. These are being repaired. Took some losses. Well, well, well. 1943. I, I think I played in 1944. The Christmas 1943 at least. Then I played for another... Well, then I played for like four years. So I expect a lot of episodes. A year per an episode, I'd say. Somewhere around that. Sweden. Infantry warfare researched. Good. Guatemala, Nicaragua. Nationalist China. I'd rather not. <laughs> Sweden. Drifting towards allies with a fairly strong current. That's good. Wish I could influence nations. I can't. Right. 
more industrial capacity down here. Put one here as well. Quebec. And Ottawa. Five more? Hell yeah. Hoy. This is good shit. And it'll all be done pretty soon. And it will grant us much more. I love this. This is great. Ooh. The Brits are taking this pretty seriously. I wonder if it's time for us to get down here and in Africa as well. Well, I'd rather be involved there than not. So we'll send down the first army. lose the ship or something? Well, I don't think we did. I think we took a bit of fire, though. Alright, guys. Spread yourself out. We're retaking Tunis. Then we're taking Tripoli. Then we're taking Benghazi. Then we're taking Tobruk. Taking uh, Cairo. Cairo and Alexandria. Moving up to Tel Aviv, Beirut, and Aleppo. This is our crusade, literally. They're getting their supplies, correct? Yes? Yes. Yes, good. <coughs> wow, looks like we're going to have a lot of uh, organiz organized uh, rebellions here. Look at this. It's all over Europe, really. Norway, Poland, Yugoslavia, France, Belgium. It's going to be a big uprising. This really bothers me, though. Germany has not declared war on the Soviet Union yet. What the fuck? Marines have landed on Ostrov Paramuzir. Lol. <laughs> Alright. And the British have taken parts of the nearby line. Japanese territories, I see. One's like, ooh, ooh, son of a bitch. Persia has just mowed their way down in here together with Japan. Oh wow, the British are down here trying to fight as well. American troops here. Italian militia down here as well. Singapore cannot fall, my friends. It's looking pretty bad for the Allies at this very moment. It's uh, the turning point of the war. Obviously, a ride a bit later than this, but uh, keep our hopes up. That's what we got to do. Ooh, as I said it. Defense. The news from the front is grim, but all is not lost. New superior weapons will turn the tide, and all we need is time to bring them into service. Fall of Leningrad. The struggle for the East continues. It's fallen into the advancing German forces. I guess they, they, they landed here or something? Destiny. Well. Shit's gonna go down. American troops here as well, helping out. I'm just doing as much as I can on this front. Actually, fuck that. Now that I think of it, I'm changing my mind all the time. They don't need help here. They need help in Europe for the for the upcoming fight. British can deal with Africa. 
It's their home territory. Look at this. This is way enough. Us Canadians are needed elsewhere. Let me see what we got. Bombay. Might fall, might not. We'll see if the persons can hold. Oh, the Soviets. I wonder, will the Germans really be able to push them back that far? Oh, it's looking pretty grim right here. But look at the American presence over here. It's militia, I know. Ah, we, if Sweden would join us now, that'd be such a sweet extra, like, good set of troops to just have in this fight. Romania, yeah, they've joined the conflict. So is probably Hungary as well. Oh, shit. Germany's pushing up. The Great Patriotic War. The fascist invader may have driven deep into the Soviet Union. Not really, but the Red Army and Red Navy are self-sacrificing and disputing every inch of Soviet soul. The Soviet people must realize that they're not hidden as this. They must mobilize themselves and refocus all their work on wartime production. There can be no mercy for the enemy. That is true. So are we. All industrial capacity is to be used... Why am I speaking with Russian accent? I am Canadian. Canadian Russian accent. Oh, look at the amount of troops just mobilized everywhere. Look. This is insanity. This, just the amount of manpower that the, they have at their disposal is just... What a force. What a force of nature. Pulling my Canadians back, though. Because my men have done well. And you'd be a heathen. <laughs> he to deny that. I think it's time for us to get some, some, some other stuff into the war now. I want some light armored, light armor and artillery. That'll be cool. Two of them. Canadian Armour Division, two of them, fourth and fifth, good. They're in production. It'll take them some time, but they're in production. Get your ass right there, now. Sweden, if they came with us... It would be such a marvelous thing. Oh, they're drifting towards the Axis. No. That would be the last thing. Look at the Allies' victory points. That's bad. They control 50% of the victory points. That is bad for us. Well, now that America's entered the war, I mean... Look at the Soviet Union taking the Finns down here from the back. Finns are fucking pushing it out pretty heavily, though. I'm not going to lie. But that, no, 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 that, I don't think the Russians are going to let them get too far in. The Russians are strong. They're fighting the Persians down here as well. They're probably... Oh, uh, yeah, they're fighting the the Japs as well. Yeah, they actually did in the World War II as well, so... Not one step backwards, comrades. Remember that? Not one step backwards. Not for Germany. This place is pretty much locked down. I'm wondering if I should be brave and just do like an invasion down here or something. Where they'd least expect it. That worked out meh. Okay. Not too good. Not too bad. I'm really just glad that the Russians joined better late than ever. But it's a bit too late. With the amount of American troops that there are right now ready to just be shipped out is insane. Most of them seem to be heading east and west. A lot of them are being obviously shipped out as you can tell here. It's a big navy there. There's another navy. There's another navy. There's another navy. Back and forth. See a lot of marines on these islands. Back and forth. Garrison troops. Yeah, they're definitely winning the Pacific Conquest right now. The Japs are holding these islands around here. 
Nauru. Dutch paratroopers. That's interesting. Down here in uh, South America. <laughs> 200 manpower. That is good. September 1943. As I told you, we're going to end it next Christmas. Christmas 1943. Oh, yeah. The Russians are just pushing it in right here. See this? Probably going to gain another territory anytime soon now. See down here. Germany pushing in as well. Romanians are fairly unsuccessful in this, as you can tell. So the Hungarians, they didn't even branch out. <laughs> Too bad for them. The Brits are still hanging on to Bombay here, but I don't know, against the Japanese and Persian troops, it'll be hard. They're holding the south here as well. And this island, Sri Lanka, or whatever it's called. I think so. Some rebellions there in here. <sighs> this is pretty bad for the Russians. They're being pushed back heavily right here. But obviously, this is going to be easier for the. make it easier for the Americans to, to take all of this and we might even see a mainland invasion considering that they've taken islands here look at this several infantry, two infantry divisions here on Naga and those islands aren't these islands are disputed today like between China and Japan might be, might not be, could be <coughs> so it's gonna be nasty for them there as well France and the Brits are soon taking Tunis here they're clearing North Africa out rebellions here and there continues ones I want to see the the mainland invasion occur soon but I think we're gonna see that in the next batch of videos my money's pretty bad my economy my bank I guess this year my troops I'm gonna have them in England them back up. Put them at this side this time. In Liverpool. Doop. Ooh. Some of our boats took some hits. But they'll be repaired. We're fine. We got a little bit of a destroyer section here protecting the transport fleet, so we'll be fine. In most cases, unless we're gonna be go going up against a big fucking destroyer or something like that, that's not pretty. We'll keep them all there, ready. They're not even close to Moscow. Look at that. It's pretty far away from the front. Yeah, the Russians are pushing them back here and there. You see that? Looking pretty good. If they can clean this up here. They'll be golden. And the British, they've secured Tunis. And they're just making their way down. I think they're going to take all of this here. Then they're going to realign with these troops and these troops. And they're going to take out Persia. And then focus on the Japs. I don't feel like that they're going to get too involved with the European theater. Because of well, the, the massive catastrophe over here in, in the Netherlands. Kind of scared them away, didn't it? I'd be. I mean, I'm not invading Norway again. <laughs> it was a good try. But, yeah. 10th of December. Yeah, by the way, the Christmas question that we had yesterday. For a lot of you people, basically Americans have the, the, the 25th. I mean, Europeans have it the 24th. It's just, I don't even know why. Could be because when it's the 25th for you, or when it's the 20th, I don't know. It would be, I, I don't know. I don't know at all the reason to that. I'll have, to, I'll have to find out. Maybe one of you guys can answer me there. So, we have finally been able to get them light medium tank brigades. 
medium tanks are, are, are good. It's going to take some more time, obviously, but it's going to be worth it. Rocket artillery is always good to have. Got no money though, so don't expect anything big popping out out of Canada. But we're getting a shit ton of industrial capacity. And I'm gonna actually abort these to put everything on the IC. So this should be pretty good. So, oh, we passed Christmas. Blast. But we're doing good here, and here's where we're gonna end it. Thank you guys for watching. My name's Simon Flex, and I'll see you guys the next time. Oh, look at this. Japs just lost a big grip of it, and so, so did the Persians. Oh, the Persians are gone. That's why they lost it. This is a messed up shit going down here. Interesting. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the series. I'm going to save it over here.